thought this was Dollar General. It is like dollar ninety general, two dollars, two for three fifty general. The sign on the front says Dollar General, okay? It does not say two dollar general. Call the manager. Okay, pull up to Moto Mart. It's uh, by my house. Uh, about to come in, go in here and see if they get the new Mountain Dew Merry Mashup uh, and some other items maybe. Try to do a little Christmas review for you guys. Um, it's cranberry stuff, I guess. So I guess you could say Thanksgiving. You know, let's not, let's not pass up Thanksgiving, folks. Gets to Halloween, then it just skips to Christmas. Come on, guys. Thanksgiving. So, um, maybe I'll do a Thanksgiving. That's what I'll do for this one, maybe. Unless there's too much Christmassy. I'll just tie them all together. But let's show Thanksgiving some love, folks. We get in here and uh, get my items. They have, they don't have the regular cranberry Sprite. They have the uh, cranberry, I think the cranberry spice. Maybe that's one, of, yeah, winter spiced cranberry. But, uh, Heard they had a regular cranberry one too, but I didn't see that. I'm gonna look for uh, the new Mountain Dew, which here it is. This is a Mary, it's called Mary Mashup. So uh, I got one of those and I got the Sprite. Uh, somebody just told me they had a ginger ale also, so I'm gonna try to find the ginger ale one as well. I might as well do, do a few different ones if they have it. But let me get these and get the show on the road. Third time I'm going back in here. Every time I come back out, somebody tells me about another drink. So I'm going to try to find some cinnamon Cokes. I mean, I don't think, I don't think they have them. But I'm, I mean, I'm going to, I'm going to look. Because that's what I do for you guys, okay? I go over and be on the call of duty. Oh, they do have it. Whew. So glad I did come in here. Now I gotta get another one to get a deal because they're two dollars a piece, but I could get a deal if I buy another one, so I get twenty-five cents off each. Uh, I don't know. There's there's no other Christmas one in here. But I, I guess I could check every single one before I leave, so I don't have to keep running back and forth. I guess good cardio. All right, out of here. Okay, guys, no ginger ale. Um, the, uh, I'm gonna check another store and get a couple of other items, but I did get a. Uh, from Walmart, I did get uh, carrot cake cookies, the Oreo cookies. Uh, I haven't tried those yet. There's, it's not a Christmas thing, but uh, I just never tried them yet. I bought some from Tasha, and uh, she never opened them up yet. So I, uh, so I uh, will try those two on the same review, probably just to to fill in some um, talking time, because you know I talk. You are not going to believe this. I believe her though, but Tasha said that she told me yesterday that Dollar General, we was talking about Pringles, uh, about doing that notorious B.O.B. Dot dot dot, uh, one can Pringle challenge, the 5.2 original um, weight Pringles. Well, she said that Dollar General had the sodas for a dollar. I was at the gas station and spent $3.50, $4.50, $5.50. 565 on three freaking 20 ounce sodas. So now I could have got five of them from Dollar General for that price. Well, I'm going here to see if they have, I'm going to go to Dollar General first next time, okay? Not to a convenience store gas station, which I knew was going to be higher anyway. But I didn't know Dollar General had all that. So surprising enough, where Tasha lives, they do have all that. Well, I'm going here first to, to find stuff now, okay? For the dollar. If I find anything for $2, I'm calling the manager. But this is Dollar General, not $2 General. All right, let me get in here. 
How you doing? All right. Well, um, like the gas station. Ooh, no, they do. Um, I don't even think that. Oh, they do have the cinnamon for the. Oh, dollar ninety. This is not Dollar General, folks. This is Dollar Ninety General. You believe me? Look at this. Dollar twenty-five General. Dollar ninety. Two for three fifty General. I'm uh, mistaken because I thought this was a dollar place. Well, I don't feel as bad now spending what I spent on it because I'm only saving like five or ten cents. But that does add up, people. Well, let me look for some other stuff. Hit my one buffet for the week and go to uh, this uh, place called Stingers in Cahokia. Um, I go for the pizza. They do have a couple other items on the on the buffet, but I'm not really interested in that. But when I go in here, I always say, "Hey, uh, did you want them in the ki in the kitchen? To go ahead and throw some pizzas in." Uh, it's a decent price. I mean, it's okay pizza. It's not the best, but hell for the price. I mean, I'll I'll go for it. But I'm gonna um, go in here and get full. This is Stingers. Uh, they they want to charge me for two buffets. Um, I've been coming here. Maybe I only come here once a month. Once every other month. Uh, they came out the back and said, hey, is it okay if we charge you for two buffets? It's uh, all you can eat. How do you do two buffets on all you can eat? So if you guys want to express your uh, feelings about this, uh, please don't come here if they're going to charge you for two buffets for one person. Uh, this is in Cahokia at Stinger, so looks like I'm not going to be eating here no more. here at the pawn shop uh, since nobody's watching all my videos like the whole videos and they keep fast forwarding and uh, not watching the advertisement I got to pawn some stuff to, to pay some bills so let me get in here <laughs> I'm only joking uh, these are some good guys uh, I go here I just sit here and talk for 30 minutes to an hour and, and shoot the breeze uh, really good people so if you're ever in the Kokia Illinois area route 3 they're not paying me for this uh, I just uh, feel doing you know good stuff for people that, that are good people. Uh, so I'm going to go in here and chit-chat with them and uh, see how they're doing. See if they got any deals in here. Hey man, I'm just uh, browsing around. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing today? I'm doing all right. I'm doing like a vlog type thing. He don't want to be in the video, but I'm gonna. Um, yeah, he gets my pickles and stuff, the hot pickles, and uh, I was gonna talk about that a little bit. But uh, I'm just gonna shoot the breeze up here, and I'll see you guys what I'm doing later. Uh, as I told you, got I'm about to tell you what happened at Stingers just now. So uh, I'll see you guys in a minute. Just got back to the house. Um, yes, I did get a good deal at Snooks. And I'm glad I didn't find this at the $1.90 general. Uh, but this is the Can Canada Dry Ginger Ale Cranberry. Uh, Tasha told me about that as well. So she is really good at uh, finding uh, different foods. I don't know how some people find them. They're like, hey, did you try the such and such, the new? Like, didn't even know they had it. So I have four different sodas to try. Um, I also have... Some other items, I, I, you have to watch the video, okay? So I'm going to put that video out probably in the next couple of days after you see this one. Uh, it's just going to be a, a food review of beverages and candies and foods. Uh, also, uh, I don't know if you saw the other vlog that just came out of Randy Sant Santel and his t-shirts were so neat, folded. Hey, Randy, guess what I got? Yes, a shirt folder. Thank you for the idea. Well, I'm opening this up now. 
this is a shirt folder. I learned I learned how to shirt fold shirts myself now because I, I folded all of my shirts uh, that I had on hand, and I got another half here for when I go to Denver and Oregon. Uh, I'll I'll have them nice nice and neatly, more professional folded. Okay, so let me let me set this up and show you how to fold a shirt real quick. Think well, so. Bam. Bam. I think you tuck the shirt in. Okay, there you go. Fold it. Cleaned up because I have a jam packed day today. That's what she said. Uh, hopefully, she didn't. Uh, I'm going to put this shirt deal up and this computer here, the SD card reader on the side is not working. So we're trying to figure out what's going on with that. They're going to have to replace the SD card reader that it's inside of this computer, like right, right there. So I don't know what's going on with that. Uh, but we need to get that fixed. So they'll be here in a second. And I, when they called me on the phone, I said, hey, I'm in town. I'm just selling crack so I can pay these bills. It was like an awkward silence. Then I said, oh, don't believe nothing I say. I'm only joking. I don't do that no more. So we maybe they'll let me uh, videotape them working on my computer. We will see. If you don't see her, then you know they didn't want me to. I will try. Well, people, people just do not want to be on my vlogs. Uh, she, she didn't want to be videoed. I think by Dell, I think she does have a viable, if that's a word to use here, having a good excuse to not be on cameras. I think Dell don't don't want their people uh, exposed. So I'm trying to bring you guys the best footage as possible. I'm sorry you have to look at this. Let me just find some more footage for you guys. Finally got this computer running. Uh, Dell, I just want you to know I thought you was better than that. I thought the company would send somebody over Looked like a temp service type person that I didn't want to judge by the the wig that was messed up on her hair. It looked like she just got done running a mile or something. Okay. But yeah, it's like arthritis maybe plus maybe some dementia slash with equilibrium problems. I'm not sure. Don't like to talk about people, but yeah i finally got she was wanting to leave without the computer being fixed saying just call this number i'm like no that's why you're here so i um called the number while she was here i didn't want to say hey you ain't going nowhere like hold them hostage like i do tasha so i was like hold on a minute let me call so she goes well it should work it should work once you put this code in some i'm like ma'am it should work. I said, I wanted to know it worked before you left. That's what you do. You fix the cars. Oh, it should work. Go ahead. But, uh, yeah, Dale, that was not even cool. Let me get to work. Yeah, it's the same day, people. I just uh, trimmed my hair up, okay? Uh, but I wanted to touch base with you with the Stingers in Cahokia. Posted it on Facebook and it got more recognition than I thought it would. And there were some people saying uh, it wasn't a buffet. I was like, well, I've been there 10 to 12 times. Uh, I've ate all I could eat. Now they want to charge me double. If it's not a buffet, why would you charge me, want to charge me double? Uh, so, yeah, a lot of people was commenting on that. But more positive than negative towards towards me. Um, but, you know, you're going to get that. Just That's just how it goes. Uh but I am going to, uh, if you follow me on Facebook, The Garbage Disposal, you'll see that post. Uh, but I'm going to, and my regular Brandon Clark uh, page on Facebook. But I'm going to go ahead and do, I was going to do the reviews another time. But I think I'm going to go ahead and try to do the uh, soda reviews 
uh, with my daughter in a couple days uh, from doing this right here. So I'm going to hold on to the vlog a couple more days, let her do a view, review with me and put it on the same vlog instead of doing a vlog and a review. I'm just going to put it all in one, okay? That's what I said. Almost said that's what she said. She did not say that. Oh, and people are getting on to me about saying that's what she said. I'm my bad. That's just me, okay? If I change everything about me that you guys don't like, this is what you're going to see. That will what you, you won't see me, okay? So I'm going to still be me. I don't mean to pee anybody off, okay? Uh, but people watch me because they want to watch me and... For me to be transparent with you guys, if you talk to me in person, you say something like that off the wall, I'm going to say, that's what she said. I'm going to say it, okay? So that's just what I do in real life. This is real life, real life situations. On my way to see Ryan at Belleville Screen Printing Company, um, used to be Adrenaline Prints. Uh, I am going to order me some more hoodies as you can see uh that i'm wearing these are thick hoodies okay look at the end of the descriptions and mm, cut, cut, cut. i have large to 3x but now i'm going to order small and medium so small to 3x uh they are uh really warm the the name brand of them is independent so if you want to look that up how thick they are compared to the regular the gildan ones are too thin for me uh, so I'm just, I'm into quality, folks. Uh, I want you to have a decent, uh, more than decent uh, material than regular for the price. I know that I am cheap, so I still want good quality with a cheaper price. So I try to give that, uh, share that with you guys as well. So uh, if you want to look at the end of the video to check the hoodies out and look in descriptions to see how to order them, uh, go ahead and do that. Uh, before they run out um, I'm going to do another shipment here shortly but for right now I'll have small to 3x uh, until um, I'll order again so if you want to make sure I have them in stock email me first to let me know that uh, you're interested and if I have them in stock for you let me hit the road and I will be at Adrenaline Prints shoot I'll be at Belleville Screen Printing Company uh, soon. So please uh, bear with me with all the bloopers that's in here. I'm not trying to do that, uh, but usually I edit everything out. Sometimes I'll leave them in now just so you can laugh and say, hey, guys, like a regular person, he's not a computer. I don't, I don't talk like this. I don't talk like this. I am efficient, productive. Hey guys, I always say hey guys. Hey, I'm going to go to hell if I don't change my ways. Hey, I had to turn around because I think I saw some candy walking. Where did that candy go? Where did the candy go? I know, I know, I saw some candy up here somewhere. Ooh, man. I think I'm losing it. Oh, she already walked in the house. It was uh, not eye candy like that. Uh, it was an older lady. She had a knitted uh, toboggan on, skull cap. She had a knitted toboggan on that was white, orange, and I think red or whatever the hell that color. White, orange, and yellow. It was actually a candy corn, so it was candy. It was a candy corn hat. I really wanted to show you guys, but she was very elusive. Man, kicked myself in the butt. Well, I tried, folks, I tried. This is the stuff I do out in the field to get extra footage. I turned around for nothing, wasted some gas, but for your guys' entertainment, that was well worth it for you not even seeing freaking what I wanted you to show you.
Hey, before you say anything, it's just a hat, okay? It matches, it matches the shoes, okay? I do not care for sports too much anymore unless it's got to do with cooking or eating. Um, people walk up to me and say, hey, F the white socks or F whatever I'm wearing. I'm like, wow, I don't even know you. That's just rude to come up and say hi. At least say hi. I don't care, guys. It just matches the outfit. So, let me get in here. Oh, man. What's going on? How you doing? Oh, good. Take his jack off, man. These things are super thick. Yes, they are. Oh. They're too warm for me inside. Oh, they'll be good for outside weather. Okay, got my hoodies ordered, guys. So I have small all the way to 3X right now. And he just told me the, the, the independent brand that I have does not make them in the 4X or 5X. So, uh, that is the story on that so i cannot get them in the quality uh that i'm getting now um i have to depreciate the quality to get you the bigger ones and i do not want to do that guys uh so apologize about that but i do have the 4x and 5x t-shirts if you guys want those on my way to the post office um i got a couple of shirts i did the live last night if you didn't catch that uh friday spin wheel of misfortune two and a half hours oh man i i think i did three carolina reapers uh a bowl full of cereal with pickle juice uh i did milk with vinegar mixed with coagulates you know it gets thick nasty i did that twice um i did a two liter of sprite and four bananas pickle pig's feet oh you gotta see that mess that's nasty uh did uh anchovies uh i ate three carolina reapers i also did uh a tablespoon of cinnamon guys don't try that at home but if you want to watch that video i just i just did that you'll see the spin wheel uh in the green background check that video out i might put it in the, um the corner here uh but Somebody won a uh, Florence Cully. Um, so I think she goes by Silver Star, um, but she won a free T-shirt. Um, also, um, Fun Uber Games won a free T-shirt, but he said to donate that. So I'm going to donate that at a event I'm at. I'm going to give him a free T-shirt. Say, hey, this is from Fun Uber Eats. Uh, he donated it, uh, so he didn't want the uh, shirt. So thank you very much for that. Um, Going to, after I deliver these, I know I talked about doing a food re, uh, food review, like a soda review with Mountain Dew with my daughter. Actually, today, peach Mountain Dew came out. Peach! Oh, my God. A peach vest is my favorite soda, uh, like a cheap ch cheap peach vest uh, or Shasta or whatever, but I think it's vest. I think vest is in St. Louis. Uh, that's I think they come out of St. Louis. Really, ooh, ooh, right, let me stop talking about it. Uh, but that's coming out today. My daughter does not do sodas, okay? So I'm not going to do the, the, the review of the Mountain Dew with her. I'll probably just do it with myself here um, soon. Um, I guess I'll do it on this video at the end of this video. Uh, but I wanted to do a lot of stuff with Neil today because I want to meet Neil. I'm going to meet my friend Tree that we did the Impossible Whopper. If it's not right here, check. If, if I don't put the card right here, uh, check out the Impossible Whopper. It was alive on his lunch break that we did that review. It almost burnt my car up. It almost burnt the top of my car. You gotta check that out. You never know what's gonna happen on this channel. So what do you have to say today, ma'am? Repent of your sins. Repent of my sins. Of your sins. Of my sins. That's right. And be baptized in the name of Jesus. Ah, la 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 la. Uh, but we'll go to Pepper Palace today, so uh, we'll get a lot of, hopefully do free samples there. So that's what is in the uh, works for today. So I'm almost at the post office now. Opens up in two minutes. I'm the only one here since it's cold outside. Yes, it's cold outside. Baby, it's cold outside. I'll sit out here and drink my coffee till the doors open in a minute and get on my way to 
go meet Neil at Walmart and see Tree. Oh, yeah, speaking of that, Tree always likes me to bring him banana bread, pecan banana bread. So I got a half a loaf here, and I'm gonna half a loaf to Neil. And uh, see ya at Walmart. Those guys look a little pretty busy today. Cause I got a recording. You don't care about being on camera, do you? All right, hey, this is Bill. He stays in Koki too, but he don't brag about it either. Did you hear about what happened at Stingers? Yeah, I heard that. Yeah, try to charge me double. I was wondering, um, do I, can I just skip everybody and get in line? Let's see. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get in here, but, uh, but, but I used to work with Bill here as well. Uh, really good guy. I'm not just saying that cause we're on camera. Really good guy. Um, how he's been going? Going good, Brandon. Good. How you been doing? Pretty I good. Can't shake your hand. I will, yeah, look at his hands. He's got the Michael Jackson uh, transparent gloves on. <laughs> Do you know any Michael Jackson moves? No. No? Okay, good. They don't like my moves either. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to get in here too as well. Maybe Patricia will share some of his banana bread with you. Will he? You got some? I got a half a loaf right here. It's a half a loaf. So you got to get. Okay, let me, uh, let me get this. I'll be right in. Sorry if Tree's not here today, and guess who's gonna get the banana bread? So, Tree, if you're watching this video, even if you watch my videos, real life situations. You got, there you go, hand off. There you go, there you go. Hey, Merry Christmas to you. All right, man, tell, tell Tree you missed out if you don't watch that video. Well, <laughs> well guys, I, hey, Bill got it. He's a great guy too, so. I'm not just saying that because I'm on the, on the camera, but he uh, he worked for a while with me um, out here. I used to be a tire lube express manager, uh, but now um, you're uh, you're looking at my job. So uh, I'm gonna go in here and try to find that uh, new Mountain Dew that came out today. It's a peach peach Mountain Dew, uh, so I can do the review uh, myself uh, because all the shows at home and and Neil and I are gonna do like a a pepper. A pepper review um, like a pepper palace review um, so a lot of hot stuff so we're gonna sample that today and try to get a challenge like I said like it's some kind of challenge video that we're gonna do in a few in the near future hell maybe we can do one today when we get to when we get it well you know that's up in the air so I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna get this real quick and I will see you guys in a minute I'll probably do another vlog on the, the fried turkey because my daughter wants a fried turkey um, and then Tasha said she'll be driving Chris I mean Thanksgiving Day to see me so I'm gonna go ahead and fry a turkey this year I bought another burner I used to borrow somebody's uh propane burner the the oven the the the, the burner part so I, I went ahead and bought a nice one uh yes uh last night after the live so I'll do another vlog on I guess cooking a fried turkey I'm gonna inject it usually I do the brine for four uh like 24 hours I do a brine on uh, like with teriyaki and pineapple usually and when I do it in the oven and I actually use uh, a big uh, a pot uh, you'll have to see one of my videos I got another video Thanksgiving brine just look up Thanksgiving brine uh, the garbage disposal and you'll see that video that's one of my edited videos that I did in the past so please be gentle with the review on that uh editing but it's really funny it's really funny so go check that out as well i am in the soda aisle you would think they would have an end cap of the new sodas uh, don't see a peach yet I'm gonna go up front where the sodas are in the impulse buy uh, cashier line that's where the impulse buys are that they put other stuff so I'm gonna go check that real quick and uh, 
hopefully I will have an update of a positive note for you. I guess they are not up on the game. You would think Mountain Dew would have it on the shelf at 12.01 a.m. for the new Mountain Dews. Uh, I see the Merry Mashup out, but today, like I said, that peach is supposed to come out. Let me just check this one more. Nope, I got the orange, the live, Merry Mashup, and the regular Mountain Dew, and the citrus one. I guess I can buy a citrus one maybe and have an extra an extra soda to review. But I guess I'm I'm gonna wait until I get the, the peach to do all the reviews at the same time. So see what I'll do. I don't know yet. See you in a little bit when I see Neil. Neil will be up here in about 30 minutes and uh, get a little chit chat with him and head to Pepper Palace. Mess with mess with her and say uh, happy New Year. It's like the first time. Hey, happy New Year! Happy New Year! You already know who it is. You don't mind being on camera, do you? What camera? This right here. Why? I do vlogs and stuff. You know that I'm a professional eater. I knew that. Oh. Professional you eater. You care about being on camera? I'm sorry. Okay. Hey. 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 Hi. Hey. hey. Uh, I always say Happy New Year when I see her because it's always late. So I say, hey, it's rude not to say it if you never saw the person. What's the rule? What you, rule? What's the rule of saying Happy New Year? There's like, no rule. do you have to say it or is it rude? Like, if you didn't see me for two weeks after the New Year, do you supposed to say? Happy New Year? Yeah. Happy New Year. Just say it, people. I mean, if you ha just say it, say it proud. Happy birthday. Happy, yes. <laughs> yeah. If you miss my birthday, that is something. That's probably rude. Like, hey, my birthday is like three months ago. Happy birthday. No, it wasn't. It's in March. But she missed it last time. Yes. Okay. Well, happy New Year. Oh, man. hey, what's going on? Hey, I'll be right back with you. I won't be rude, but Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Yeah, this, this is something that we and her got to go going on. You don't mind me on camera, do you? All right. All right, man. This is D. Uh, we used to work with him out there. Uh, Tree, is, is he slacking off and going to Amazon? I heard he's going to Amazon, people. No, he gone. He's back. Is, is he? Yeah, he's back. Oh, okay. Well, he's taking off today. Well, I'm not going to say nothing, but Bill, uh, Bill got some banana bread up there. Oh, His tree didn't get it, and I didn't see you. <laughs> get get, get a slice, yeah, he'll get you know. He's still there, huh? Yeah. I think that what happened to you, man, they tried to charge you double, huh? Yeah, see, he knows, too. The word's out on the street. Yeah. Stingers and Coke, you're trying to charge me double for a buffet. I pray. waiting for Neil but I was in there um getting my my soda that uh from one of my sodas from my review but uh oh man since I got the cameras running Neil's over here in the skies on, he's got he's got his uh hat and his glasses on and he's in the skies uh, let me get this turn around this way all right what's going on guys hey I told him already we're gonna go to Pepper Palace I've been here a little while I actually almost got accused of stealing somebody's wallet damn it <laughs> yeah I was in there and um the guy was looking he didn't accuse me he was looking at me up and down like I just was here and I left my wallet on the counter. 
he he came out here and get into his car and he left it in his car. Yeah. So I said, uh, I said, I'm getting old too. That's how it goes. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go to Pepper Palace. Um, is there anything? You said they got free samples and stuff. Uh, as far as maybe. I know, yeah, it's been a while. I've maybe watched a couple reviews. Maybe they'll let us try something else. It's Somebody said last night in the challenge, they said something about the end. Yeah, it's an extract, which I hate extracts. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll uh, <laughs> we'll see what we're gonna do. I, we're gonna go to Pepper. First time I've been there. You ever been there? No. Okay. First time we're gonna be there. We're gonna try to set up a tripod. See if they let us and do taste, you know, Just samples there, yeah? and maybe pick out a challenge for the future. So cool we will out. we will see. Uh, let me go ahead and shut this camera off. We will head up there. I got you banana bread too. Nice. You like uh, oh, pecans? Yeah. You're allergic? No. Okay. No. So I got uh, my buddy Tree that did an impossible uh -huh. whopper. It was yeah. right here. We did it. We did it right here. So that's where you did it right here. Yeah, nice. but he got a half a loaf and yeah. you got a half a loaf. But he wasn't here today, so I gave it to my other friends. So <laughs> sorry, Tree. I said it again in the video. Dang it. Sorry. <laughs> I tried. It's the thought that counts. <laughs> here I am. I'm in the studio or kitchen okay i can't afford both okay kitchen studio kitchen studio you're dizzy already okay i'm editing the video from the other days and a little bit of today okay uh when i met neil that that was today tomorrow uh video please tune in it's going to be part two of two same title but it says two of two not one of two uh i'm going to put some as soon as you see this though there's a little bit more after this so hold on Stop. Collaborate and listen. Ice, ice, baby. All right, stop. Collaborate and listen. That's, that is uh, vanilla ice. My bad. Uh, but I'm going to put a little bit of some outtakes from tomorrow's video in the end of this one. So hopefully you would really need to tune in because there's some funny stuff that happened. Really. So no lie. Don't lie on Saturdays and today's Saturday. Actually, it's Monday because you're watching it Monday. So I'm going to have to lie and say today is Monday. You're seeing I'm talking right now. Oh, this is like back to the future stuff. 88 miles per hour. If you guys do not know how hard this is. That's what now I'm going to say it. Hey guys, um, we're gonna try this nasal napalm in a minute, but you gotta give this guy here 10 minutes. I told you, my this gold camel, is dying. this camel has to refill that water. <laughs> my gold I didn't even bring, I didn't even get no water. That's two dollars or something. I can't yeah, afford. Does that count as one item? One item? <laughs> Did you get 10 items? Just, yeah. Is that kind of one item? Guys, we just made an executive decision because, uh, what's your name again? Andrew. Andrew said that running the gauntlet would not be a great idea. Yeah, no, I've tried the uh, nasal napalm with the end a couple times and it is not fun. I think you said he not closed the store down for a little bit. Yeah, 15 minutes. <laughs> yeah. So I took a so, breather. Okay, so I'm, I'm, we're going to do that one today. I'm going to get a bottle. I'm going to buy a bottle and uh, put uh, do that probably at home. Oh, man. Well, you know what, guys? I do want to try the other one. Let's do the end. I'll do a small. I'll do a smaller amount of the end. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and do the whole kit and caboodle. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're signing. We're signing our death certificate. Huh? That's misery, right? Misery. Look at that, folks. Look at that. And I got a little less, and I don't care. Okay. So you can give me a thumbs down all you want. All right, guys. So we did everything that we could in here in hot, extreme, 
and now the, the nasal napalm and this. I should put a little nasal napalm on top He's of this. Huh? He's an enabler. Okay, you ready to go? Sink it and dink. Dink it and sink it. Yeah. Hey guys, I have hoodies in. The name brand are independent, so you know they are thick and high quality. I am have them all the way from small to 3X, uh, only in black right now, so just go ahead and look in descriptions for that. Uh, I do have uh, t-shirts as well. The name brand of the t-shirts are Canvas. Uh, they are thick, they are soft, the logo wipes off like a bib, just like on the hoodie. So if you want those, please check in descriptions. Uh, they all are pre-washed materials, so they won't shrink on you. So check in descriptions for the price and the uh, shipping and handling of that, because I do ship in U.S. and in Canada. If you haven't already, um, hit follow on The Garbage Disposal on Facebook and follow me there to get more pictures and stuff. Uh, please subscribe to my page. Hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming videos. And hit the like button if you like it. Other than that, please share it with your friends, family, and even your boss. Have a great day, unless you made other plans.